Hey guys, and welcome to my first video ever on this channel. Um, today, I'm, for my uh, channel, I will be showing you all of my um, airsoft guns and BB guns. Um, so we'll start off with the uh, airsoft guns. So right here, uh, and for all you people out there, the, the safety is on all of them. Um, but right here, this is the Walther P22. Um, so there it is. As you can tell, it's quite small compared to some of these guns. But compared to that, it's pretty small. But there it is right there. Here, I'll show you the, well, it can slide back like that so it does um slide back over here is the walther p99 there it is right there tell the safety's on but it also slides back and i'm gonna have to find a spot to put my phone if i want to do this hmm. Hmm. Oh well. but uh, let me put this down real quick What I like about this gun is it's got this little catch, so every time it's out, it'll do this, like the real gun would. And then to let it go, you just push that in. The last airsoft gun I have is the, this is a red jacket, which by the way, I don't think is longer in business. I think they got a taken out of business, but it's a red jacket. Um... I don't know where the model number would be. Yeah, um, doesn't have a model number on it, but as you can tell, it is a red jacket. Um, and this one is powered by CO2. All of these others are spring-loaded. Well, we'll start with this one. This is the Walther Carl... Well, this is the Walther PPKS BB gun. So this is a BB gun, by the way. It is also CO2 powered, which the CO2 is. You pop this little thing off. So you can tell you pop that off, and there's a CO2. Now, I'm not really sure what this gun is modeled after. Um... But to me, the red jacket looks a lot like a Glock. If I can get this back on there. But I think this looks... It's got the same frame as a Glock, I think. So that is the Glother PP20... PPKS. Sorry. And as you can tell, it is um, all metal. Like, the slide is metal. The whole frame is metal, except for these pieces and that right there. The little twist on thing but everything else on here is metal so it's very heavy this right here is the Umorex um, TDP 45 as you can tell right there um, this is a BB gun and it is CO2 powered which is The red jacket looks identical to the Umorex, as you can tell here. We'll put them side to side here. Compare them. I mean, they are identical. So there, I'll flip them over. Now the Umarex does have a little bit more weight to it because it is a BB gun, um, but as it, I forgot to mention with the red jacket, the CO2 is also just like this. You flip that up, there it is, and then you can pull this thing down right there, and it will twist it. So that's my uh, Airsoft and BB gun collection. You can tell I've got five guns. Uh, for Christmas, I would love to get a... Glock Gen 3 
uh, a Glock 19 replica. Um, but it's kind of expensive. But anyway, I, I'm gonna. I'm also gonna show you the magazines with these. So there's a the magazine with the Walther P22. There's a magazine with the Walther P99. And for some reason, with the red jacket and the uh, Umarex, I never do that. A BB will come out, but that's always fine. But that's what the magazine is for the red jacket. Over here to the Walther uh, PPK S. Very tight. So use two hands, but that's what the magazine looks like there. And it just slides right in there. Lastly, for the Umarex, same thing as the red jacket. Although, it is BBs. So, my favorite out of the two is probably either the. Not for these two, these three airsoft guns, I've had them forever. And they've worn out. Like you can see there, I had to use a zip tie to replace that. This one. As I, as I mentioned, how it slides back and locks, it gets caught sometimes, and this one, this, the trigger's kind of messed up, but, so yeah, but, anyway, my favorite is going to be the Umarex or the, this, this is a great small gun, so, if I want to pretend like I'm concealed carrying it, right there on my hip, very small gun, although it is heavy, the heaviest gun that I've got, probably, but, uh, this one's probably my favorite, it's light, it's power, it's the most powerful, I think, um, whenever it's got full CO2 in it, but, I can tell it's pretty bulky, um, and big, a lot bigger than the Walther, well, I wouldn't say a lot, but, just wider frame and stuff, but, anyway, so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.